Hey, you know, we've been living in Deluna now for about 10 months and we absolutely think it's great. So we're close to shops, we're close to Brownwood Paddock Square, we're close to Edna's on the Green. We're probably a 20 minute uh, golf cart ride down to Sawgrass Grove with more entertainment, lots going on and things like that. So right now we've, we feel like we're pretty centrally located in the villages, but actually that's going to change. Once that Bexley Bridge is completed, Hey everyone, you guessed it, TB here coming to you live from the villages. Another beautiful day, hope you're all doing great out there. Hey look, um, if you watch one of my previous videos where I outline more villages that are coming to the area, there's one that kind of stands out to me and uh, it's kind of flying under the radar a little bit and that's going to be the village of Eastport. It's going to truly be unlike anything they've ever done here in the villages before. So today, I'm going to walk you through the village of Eastport, how it's going to be laid out, how it's going to be different, from all the previous villages that have been built here. And finally, is it too good to be true? So with that said, let's get into the video. Hey, let's start out by looking at the Bexley Bridge. Here you can see there's gonna be four lanes of traffic. There's also gonna be a golf cart path along with a walking path. This is uh, coming along quite nicely. And a uh, big shout out to Papa Pineapple for these overhead drone shots. So let's take a look at Eastport. This first ever blend of recreation and lifestyle a town center combined with amenity-based recreation. This heavily lake-centric community will provide a walkable experience for its residents. So as we zoom out a bit, take a look at this unique layout. As you can see, typical amenities are close together, all within walking distance of each other. Oh, and did I mention that the town square and shopping will be located along the waterfront, a first of its kind. As we come down along Central Parkway, you can see an executive golf course will be carved out between residential housing along with a driving range and a state-of-the-art golf teaching academy. An amazing softball complex, basketball, sports pool, tennis, shuffleboard, bocce and more, along with a brand new rec center, which will be the first ever home of indoor pickleball courts here in the villages. That's a first. I'm sure a lot of people are going to be excited about that along with a carved out island termed Sunset Island, which is gonna be a great place to watch your sunsets at night. Taking a closer look at the lake, you can see that a walking path is planned and that should go about three quarters of the way around the lake. You also can see that a brand new hotel here will be located right along the water. Now let's not forget to mention that this area will also be home to a town square, shopping and restaurants, giving it a more intimate feel than Lake Sumter. So if you've been following along with what's been going on here in the villages, you can clearly see that Eastport is completely different in so many ways. This lake-centric design provides a unique combination of recreation and lifestyle, something that we've never had here before in the villages. You know, you can go out, you can play pickleball, you can uh, finish up there, walk over to a local restaurant, have some lunch. Don't forget there's gonna be a town square and shops and restaurants right along the water, which is gonna give it a totally feel, uh, different feel than uh, Lake Sumter. This is gonna be more intimate, more European type feel. I think it's gonna be really great. People are gonna love it. So let's not forget, there's also going to be a golf training center with a driving range and executive golf course located right nearby. Brand new rec center. Also, they're going to have indoor pickleball. And let's not forget Sunset Island where you can go with your significant other and watch a beautiful sunset. Now, one of the things we haven't talked about is there's uh, plans for a teaching hospital in that area as well, which is going to be a huge draw for new doctors and they're trying to bring in new technology and things. So that's going to be a definite plus here for people in the villages. So. Is it too good to be true? Well, you know, it kind of almost is, but living here in the villages now, I'm not surprised by anything. So Eastport is still a few years out, but with the completion of the Bexley Bridge, I think that timeline is gonna move up quicker than anybody could even imagine. And for me, I just can't wait. So now Deluna may not be centrally located anymore, but with Eastport up and running, I just, I'm okay with that. It's just gonna be more things to see and do here in the villages. Now remember, please do your own research, right? I'm not affiliated with the villages in any way. I'm not a realtor in Florida. I'm just a guy providing information. If you found this information and this video helpful, please like and subscribe, hit that notification button. It really does go a long way. We're making a strong push to try to get to a thousand subscribers so you can help us out. That would be great. And as always, stay awesome, everyone. Now make sure you're doing your own...
research can hurt. <laughs> now, please remember to do your own research and and I don't know what else. Do something. <laughs> Watch more videos. <laughs> do learn and more. <laughs> so look, remember, do your own research as. A, Okay. <laughs>